Newborn must have Baby Breza Sterilizer For Mom's Rocker Donkadet Halo Swivel Sleeper Tomo Tomo Bottles Haka Breast Pump This is part two of must-have items that, as a first-time mom, you should register for. If you live in a two-story, three-story home, you need a changing station on every floor. This is what we have on our first floor, and we use it every single day, multiple times a day. I keep it stocked with diapers, wipes, spot rash cream, um, aquaphor, whatever we need, it's in this changing station. And then she can sleep in the bassinet too, if I don't wanna walk her upstairs to her crib. It saves us so much time. We're not walking up and down the stairs with a crying baby who needs her diaper changed. We love it. We use it every single day, multiple times a day. Item number two is this diaper rash spatula thing. We use this all the time. We were just fighting diaper rash with our little one after she was on extreme antibiotics. And we use this probably 50 to 60 times a day putting on diaper cream. We didn't have to wash our hands as much after. We didn't have to scrub it down. Your hands don't smell like diaper rash cream. It is a life. My newborn must haves. Part one. Mom Boggles. I originally had Tom Tippy and changed to mom within a week. Timmy caught. Alex Sock. My must have. If you struggle to sleep at night from worry, you need this. Tommy Tippy. Perfect prep. A godsend for night feeds. This is literally the most genius thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Throw some soap in there and have a clean bottle in seconds. baby is three weeks old and this is what's been working for our room share bedside setup. We have the halo bassinet set up on my side of the bed for easy nighttime feeding and on my nightstand we keep the Outlet Smart Sock, the Hatch Sound Machine, a hand sanitizer and my water bottle as well as a humidifier. The left side of my drawer is where I keep all my supplements and then on the right side is where I keep all of my breastfeeding essentials like breast pads, the Haka, milk storage containers, and a bunch of products from the Freedom Online, as well as a lactation bar. And that's everything I keep in my nightstand for easy access. On the side of her bassinet, I have attached a little pacifier holder. And in the side pocket, we have a bunch of extra burp cloths because we go through them so quickly. Finally, my last essential is a mini fridge because our bedroom is upstairs. I use it for extra water and to store my breast milk, and yeah, this is what's been working for us with our newborn. Organizational items that you are going to want for your nursery. First up are these drawers. These are in her closet and they're super helpful for organizing all of the baby stuff that comes along with babies. And I know you guys are going to ask for the link, so find it under nursery links in my bio. When you go there, you're also going to see these bin clips, which are awesome for organizing all over the house. With all of the tiny clothes, you're gonna want drawer dividers. We use them in every single drawer of the dresser. These are really helpful for hanging clothes. Fabric bins like these are great for storing future sizes and memorabilia. 